So it has a brew. Subsequently in the lens mug because, um, well, because my other mug, it's just boring and bland and I didn't really figure, um, I figured I may as well bring out the lens mug again. Anyway, um, I've actually had my, my buzz cut as well and I've also had my birthday, um, which was on Friday. I'm going to show you, I'll put some pictures up of the cake that my mum made. I thought it was not a bad effort considering she didn't have much time. It's supposed to be raspberry pie. Um, and yeah, I, th I think it's a really good effort to be fair, like considering she had like just an afternoon to do it. I didn't think it was a bad effort because um, that's what I requested. She asked me what type of birthday cake I wanted. I said, yeah, raspberry pie cake. And she was like, what the shit is that? And so I showed her a picture and she was like, oh, I'll try and do that. And um, it didn't come out as well as she'd hoped because she didn't have time, but I didn't think it was too bad. I'll also put some links in the description below where you can find it on uh, Flickr and things like that. So, I thought I'd talk a little bit about um, Xbox Live because um, there's some idiots going around on Twitter that haven't got a fucking clue about um, what's going on with it and also moaning PlayStation Network idiots um, that they reckon that Xbox Live has been hacked. Well, I can assure you it hasn't been hacked at all. It was just some routine maintenance they obviously did on the servers and for whatever reason shit got shit got real and, um, and it brought down the servers, which is a bit crap. Um, but to be fair, it's still a more reliable and better service than PlayStation Network. So um, I don't know what... There was loads of people saying, oh... Um, Oh, oh, Xbox Live is down. Oh, such a reliable service. Quote, you know, in inverted commas. I'm like, yeah, but you know, PlayStation Network's crap. Um, Xbox Live is still worth paying for. IMO, I think it's an amazing service, and it's been down what, what, a couple of days maybe, if that. They've still got some problems with uh, Minecraft not connecting, but who gives a shit if you play Minecraft on the console? I weep for you because it should definitely be playable on PC. Um, you don't even need a beastie PC to run it. You could probably run it on your laptop, to be honest, if you've got. And it doesn't cost that much on PC. It's like 17 quid or whatever. Um, so, yeah, a lot of people were saying it was going to be hacked. It was, it was hacked by Anonymous and a few other people, but that didn't happen. Some rigid maintenance happened, and according to Microsoft, shit got real. It didn't quite go through properly, and that is why... Um, shit broke basically um so for whatever reason i assume they they installed a patch and for whatever reason it brought down the servers um which is a bit of a bug it happens in it all the time um but unlike sony they didn't bring it down for a month um there's microsoft do do routine maintenance and sometimes they take them down they usually inform users and they take it down for an hour maybe uh, at a time but they don't generally take it down for that long um but yeah it was just basically server maintenance Bit of a bugger, but you know, such is life. Shit happens. Still a worthwhile service to pay for. IMO. I th I'd still quite happily pay. Question: How much it is a year? Um, I do have an Xbox, which I don't really pay or play very much anymore because I have a PC and because I haven't got enough time and because the only thing I've really got on there to play is Call of Duty, and I can't really be bothered to play that. Um, so I think that's it, really. It's going to be a really quick brew time because I've not really got much to talk about. I will put a link in the description below for the Xbox service status um, because people that camp are too fucking lazy to Google Xbox Live status, um, you can find it there. Um, and I'm trying to think where the original yeah it was Game Informer, which I'll also put the link in the description below of the um, the well basically saying what happened with Xbox Live because um, nobody seems to actually say much about it. They just say oh what about always online DRM, which is another point. Always online DRM will be a pain in the backside. Um, when the 720 comes out if shit like this happens again um, but anyway apart from that uh, the other thing I need to mention tomorrow which will be Wednesday I will be doing a well hopefully I will be doing a turn your old PC into a router video and um, we're going to play around with some untangle we might play around with some IP fire as well but I'm not too sure I think what I'll do is I'll do a series of DIY networking shit for um, and we've got I've got a project uh, surrounded surrounded with that in terms of YouTube. Um, we're going to turn an old PC into an Untangle router. We might play around with IP5. I need to I need to personally have a look at that one myself because IP5 I've never actually tried. We might also try PFSense, but PFSense is quite advanced, um, especially if you've never done like major business networking before and stuff. So. Uh, we're going to do that hopefully tomorrow because I've now got my lapel mic, which will be shitty sound, but it'll be better than um, it'll be better than um, my Samsung mic when I'm wandering about the place. So, apart from that, I'll just catch you in a later video.